Hey, so I know you guys are loving the outfits of the day. So I'm gonna show you my outfit for today and this is from Forever 21 also. I didn't include this in my haul just because I didn't wanna make it too long. I was, that the, actually when I put up that video, uh, I was kind of in a hurry to leave. I, I pretty much got ready all day. I was just taking my time, relaxing. I don't have the kids today. I took them to my kid, to my mom yesterday, and she took them to Universal Studios today. So I'm really happy about that. They just called me. They're having a great time. So today we're gonna take advantage. Like we're on a little mini vacay, you know, stay k when you stay home, but you're on vacation. But yeah, so today we're gonna go to Buffalo Wild Wings and um. This is my outfit. It's just a casual um, kind of like jersey, plain black jersey with the two white things right there. And then my pants are like this. This is how my pants look. They have like openings right here. I This is um, Forever 21 plus size collection. And then I just have the same earrings I wore yesterday. I usually... <sighs> Usually I always just brush my hair out if I curled it the day before I'll just leave like the little bit of curls that it has just Throw it throw it however it lays is how it lays and I brush it put a little hairspray Make sure my baby hairs are just a little bit flat ironed because Those could get out of control, but I just make sure my baby hairs are in control This part is nice and the rest I don't really fuss about my hair too much, but yeah, so same necklace, same earrings. Um, my makeup is a little different. So yeah. And then I'm I'm deciding on what glasses to wear. I have these two glasses. And I everybody is loving these glasses. Um where did I get them at? I got them at the mall actually, at the in the middle of the mall, and they were only seven bucks. But you can get them in downtown LA for five dollars. I didn't feel like going downtown LA. I was at the mall, I was at Forever 21, and in the middle of the Montebello Town Center. So if you go to the Montebello Town Center, um, you'll probably see me there because that's where I shop sometimes. Like when I have like when I want to go to Forever 21 or I want to go to a main store, I'll probably go to the Montebello Town Center. So if you do go to the Montebello Town Center, um, in the middle of the mall, you know the carts in the middle of the mall, you will find these glasses. So I bought these, which these are my favorite ones. These are my go-to. Like these, I will never like, <sighs> I don't feel complete when I have these glasses. These are like, I want to say like my sixth pair buying. Um, when I first found them, I found them at... Where did I first find them at? I think it was a mall in Buena Park. I was in Buena Park. I was going to Nosbury Farm and I found these at the mall. And I was like, yes. And then I did find them at my own mall and I've just been buying them ever since. Every time they break or I lose them or anything, I buy other ones. And then I found these, which these are really fucking hip. Like I'm feeling these. I think I'm gonna wear these because these just make me look brand new. But yeah. I don't know, YouTube has me feeling some type of way now. People are talking about how they're cracking down and they're, I, I just don't get it. Like, I really don't get it. There's there's a lot of people here that say and do worse stuff than me. And I mean, they obviously have, you know, world star and all that stuff on here. I guess you're not gonna get paid for it. Like if you cuss and you do too many wild things. So I just have to really sit and contemplate and like, I don't know, rethink my YouTube just because I do like to cuss and that is me and it makes me feel comfortable to be myself and just to not have to censor myself. That's what I feel more authentic. Um, when I first started YouTube, I first started, um, I don't want to bend down. When I first started YouTube, um, I wasn't, it was hard for me. If you see some of my, my first videos, I still have them up. A couple of them where I'm trying to explain stuff, it's hard for me to talk on camera. I'm kind of trying to be professional. I'm kind of trying to like censor myself and I don't feel comfortable. Like it wasn't, it was like, I guess I honestly feel like that's why my YouTube wasn't picking up because I wasn't being myself all the way. And when I was able just to 
when I was able just to, you know, you know what, Chunky, you know what, D, just fucking be yourself. Like, I just said the F word right now. Like, you know what I mean? It's like, that's how I would talk to my friend, you know, to my sister-in-law, to my brother, to people around me all the time, every day. And that's how I wanted to be with you guys. I wanted to interact like I was talking to you on the daily basis. Like, that's me. And it's nothing's forced. Nothing's, um... That's why YouTube has become so fun for me. And so, I, I love it even more because I was able to just, hey, just be yourself. And people are going to like you. And people are going to like it. And, you know, people are going to see you in them and it's gonna draw them to you because they're gonna say hey that's how i talk to my friends or with with my friends and stuff like that it's just and then at the same time i'm kind of i kind of love to be controversial like i kind of love that i kind of love to live on the edge and shit you know so i just have to see what's gonna happen um see where youtube's gonna take that hopefully they don't have it for long I don't know what's going to happen, but I guess I'll just, I don't know if I have to conform, if I have to censor myself more, it's going to be really hard, but that's just some thoughts for today. So let's go to Buffalo Wild Wings. Let's some, eat some grub because I'm hungry and it's already, what time? It's already, I think 12 o'clock and I have not ate. I've been getting ready all morning. I, I did take long, but I was just kicking it. Like I would do my makeup or I, got, I took a shower and then I just laid down for a while and just enjoyed the silence. <sighs> Listen to that. Silence. I needed this break. So yeah, happy Labor Day. Love you guys. Let's go. So we're going to Buffalo Wild Wings. Um, we're gonna go eat. But I haven't told you this yet, babe, and I wanna tell you on camera to see how you feel because I was kinda talking to them about it earlier when I was showing them my outfit. But supposedly, there's these new guidelines to YouTube that they're gonna be starting where you have to like, you can't cuss that much and like your videos can't have like vulgar stuff in them and stuff like that. So you kinda like, like, vulgar like um okay let's see let's see okay so the, the the when i first heard about it i heard about it from sanders so whoever watches sanders on here he's he's blowing up i really like him i really like how controversial he is um he did a video talking about how he got raped okay um. and then and then so he that that video got censored to where people can't watch it but there's a lot of other videos people telling their stories of how they got molested and stuff like that it's an edge it's it's almost like an educational it helps people you know what i mean why would you why would you censor that video you know what i mean like it's it's an educational video it's telling you what they went through also i think he did a video saying how his mom had aids or something like that and they've censored it if i i, I might be wrong but i think he said that mo that video or another video that he did but you know and they censored it where he can't he, he can't monetize it like he can't make video he can't make money off of it and i'm just like okay i don't know exactly what they're gonna be doing and supposedly like if you cuss too much and stuff like that you can't make money off that video so i'm just like i'm kind of tripping because i'm just like i finally gotten comfortable on youtube to the fact where i could be myself you know and not have to think oh shoot like i can't say this or i can't say that like you know it's it it was pretty hard for me to get on youtube and not put any songs on it it's been hard for me to do that because music is kind of what gets me through my day you know and and music is is a part of my day all the time every day all day like music is is us right babe music kind of you know despite how the world is messed up things going on in the world you know your life might not be going that well you might be stressed out your kids might stress you out but once you put that music on that takes you to like it just really it just takes you to another world and and, it, and it's hard for me not to put it on YouTube when I'm on YouTube it's hard for me because I want to hear I want to put my music I want to sing to my music I want to fill my music with you guys and it's just it, that's been hard but I kind of got used to it you know lower the music do your YouTube thing and then you could go back to listening to your music but 
for me to try to censor myself. I don't know. I don't know. Hey, can I stop somewhere real quick? For what? I always want to stop at it, but... Yeah, go ahead. Just know that I'm really hungry. All right, let's just go. And I, I ha I'm like, yeah, we'll go after. Like, I'm really freaking, freaking hungry. <laughs> 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 I'm I was going to say effing, but I don't know. Because, you know... Being in what? Okay, so we're here at Buffalo Wild Wings. And, yeah... I don't know if anybody else seen it the way it looks, but I'm gonna show you guys how it looks. I think I'm gonna get a Bloody Mary. It's almost like a chalada, right? A Bloody Mary is like a chalada? And I think I'm gonna get this right here. I know it's like wings, I know it's Buffalo Wild Wings, but um, I'm really hungry and I don't think wings are gonna fill me up. Burger. Yeah, I think I'm gonna get the turkey burger. And I think it comes with this too, this whole meal. Just give me this, I'll take that. <laughs> what are you gonna get, babe? Wings? Oh, yeah. He loves wings. wings Oh yeah, we're gonna get that to share. That's what we're gonna get to share. And this. And that. And that. And that. And this. <laughs> So we're 
done. It was really good. The wings were really hot. And now we're going to go to H Mart. I'm going to go to two places. I'm going to go to H Mart to get a few groceries. And then, um, oh, look at this Trader Joe's. I'm going to try to go to Trader Joe's. I'm going to try to go to Trader Joe's next week. But um, I'm going to go get a few Asian delights just for my house. And um, just because I personally, I do like Asian food. And um, I, I do have Asian in me. So I do like Asian food. So, you know, um, then I'm going to go to Food for Less just to get um, some of the stuff that the kids like. Like macaroni and cheese. Um, Vienna, Vienna wieners that the kids like. They like to eat snacks. My kids are very... Uh, I made headstrong little girls. They're just like me. He's very stubborn too. You guys don't... You, you guys have never seen that side of him because you guys don't see a lot. You know, this is YouTube. There's a lot you don't see. But uh, he is very stubborn. So we have two very stubborn children. Okay? Very stubborn. They're beautiful. They're sweet. They're smart. But they're very headstrong. Okay, so we were just talking about, we were tripping out how on our waiter, like, our waiter was so nervous, and I thought just because maybe it was his first day, but, like, I was observing his, I was observing his, um, like, the way he was interacting with other people, and I was kind of getting mad because they left us, like, I told him, like, oh, you know, like, the cheesy wedges that we got, I was like, oh, you know, like, there's not enough cheese on them, like, they're dry. He's like, oh, it's the lighting. I'm like, what? Like, he was all nervous. He's like, ma 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 maybe, oh, no, you know, no, it was the lighting. It's the lighting. And I'm like, like oh, okay, you know what? All right. You know, like, I'm not even going to deal with it. Like, fuck. And then when we kept trying to get his, his attention, like, he was ignoring us. But then, like, whenever I would talk to him, he'd be, like, really nervous. I'm just like, yo, you're, like, cool with all these people. Did you see how cool he was with the people on the, on the side? He didn't see her. See that place, it ain't open. It ain't open anymore? Yeah, but we were just tripping out how like he was getting nervous when I was talking to him. I don't know why, it was weird, but he, yeah, he was really nervous talking to me. We were just tripping out on it. We've been seeing a lot of these weird cars. Look at that. We've been seeing a lot of those weird cars. Oh, thank you. <laughs> The lady moved back, thank you. Um, yeah, but look at So I'm gonna do an H, quick H Mart haul. I got a few things. I didn't get a lot. Let me show you what I got first. Um, the dry ingredients. We put the dry ingredients. We put the cold. Oh, here's a mess. I was being down in the car. I'm so tired. We put the cold stuff in the fridge. So um, the first thing I got was these noodles right here. These noodles right here. I heard that they were really delicious, and they have olive oil in them. So that really intrigued me that it was olive oil in these. But you can even smell them through the package. They smell so good. So I can't wait to try these and eat these for breakfast, lunch, dinner, whatever the fuck I want. And then I got two packs of spicy noodles. Two packs of spicy noodles, one for my friend and um, one for me because I am going to do another spicy noodle challenge with my man because I really want him to try it and I want to see like if he could handle it. Um, these are very fucking spicy, okay? I don't know, for some people they're not. Um, my friend Sarah here on YouTube, make sure you go check them out. Sarah and Chachi, I love them, they're my friends. Um, they're a really great couple. Uh, they tried, she tried a little bit. I want to see her eat a lot. I want to see her to see if she could eat a lot. She was saying they weren't that spicy, but you know, they are when you eat a lot. But anyway, so yeah, I'm going to give one pack to my friends. They know who they are. I'll let them tell you on their channel or yeah, I'll let them tell you on their channel when they do it. But yeah, so two spicy noodles. Two spicy noodles. Okay, um, the cold stuff I got. Okay, so I got some dumplings. I got two different kinds. They, they, the, usual, the usual ones that I always buy, they didn't have them. They had these like other brand, but I'm going to try them out. So this is one of the um, dumplings I got. And I got this kind too. Dumplings. And then I got some kimchi. This kind of kimchi. I got this kind before and it's really good. This is the brand right here. Ooh, it smells good. Okay, so, and then I just got a carton of eggs because their eggs are really cheap. It was $1.99 for a big pack of eggs. So I got me some eggs and some chile. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Small haul, small H Mart haul. Um, yeah, so, uh, peace out. This will probably be the end of the vlog. I am just going to food for less next, but I said that's pretty much it. I got the cultivated music that you captivate me who listens to the words that I speak as I take me a drink to the middle of the street. From the city of Compton to surf me, not for the cherry on top, the one I bust my lips. Down the street, smoking in dope, sipping on gin and juice. With my mind on my money and my money on my mind. Rolling down the street, smoking in
pointing the mic right here. Oh, it sounds right now. where I eat my fish tacos and one of my mukbangs, I, I got a burrito. 